This is one of seven videos presenting the units of learning outcomes developed through the Pirate project. Please also watch the introduction video about earth building and our European project. Equit Earth Building is a matrix of nine units of learning outcomes designed to create new teaching content and certifications. Unit R is the unit of the Equit Earth Building that covers the skills for maintain, repair, renovation, restoration of already existing earth buildings and plasters. Earth walls are resistant. They withstand many centuries even under severe climate conditions. Human communities have learned how to process local topsoils to build simple, often huge constructions to live and work in, beautiful and functional. Shrinkage and setting cracks often are the only defects. Most of the time they happen when the building was new and not changed since. Normally they don't affect the stability and sustainability of the wall. As the buildings withstand many decades and centuries of useful life, they are exposed to wear and tear and, more important, changes in use, maintenance and the needs of their inhabitants. This is when repair and rehabilitation are needed. Earth walls are not only robust, but also patient and will withstand many different interventions, as long as they stay dry. A professional in charge of repair and transformation of an earth building starts by making a global analysis of the building and its situation. The history of previous interventions on both the walls and the area around the building, for example ground level, drainage, sidewalks, slabs, surface treatments, repair materials. Any damage due to water and moisture. Structural damage either severe, evolving or not. Aesthetic aspects. Identifying causes of damage and solutions to solve them is a part of the repair and conservation process. There are three major objectives for repair and rehabilitation works which often overlap. Creation of new openings, repair of water and moisture damage, upgrading comfort with thermal insulation and new services for water and electricity. Often these works go hand in hand with renovation of coatings. In old buildings, work often starts with removal of previous repairs, coatings and materials that are not appropriate. The choice of repair material generally needs testing to determine the mixed proportions. For rebuilding parts of a wall, a different technique from the original building method can be used. For example, bricks or light clay in an old rammed earth, or cob wall which can speed up the repair. Connection between old and new, and between earth and other materials, needs particular attention, as earth shrinks when drying, cracks should be anticipated. As clay does not bind chemically, we can wake it up any time, that is the magic of earthen structures. Water penetrates the clay minerals, activating cohesion and plasticity. Therefore, connecting new to old is always possible. This property also enables recycling of used materials and cutoffs. Structures often have to be propped during repair works. Risk assessment is an important competence for repair works. Depending on the size and complexity of the repair site, and the experience of the craftspeople, the intervention may require input from a structural engineer. However the work is done, and whatever the scale of works, it is likely to be one in a sequence over the lifetime of the building, longevity and adaptability being two key strengths of earth buildings.